Hey guys, it's Jazz from Hunk Hunk of Burning Reviews, and uh, I hope you're all having a great day. I've got a, a lovely little party hat that just came today, and it is uh, the chauffeur's hat. This part is solid, this part not so much. It's a uh, weird, just fabric ish. Um, definitely not like the usual chauffeur hats that I've seen but as far as wearing it for Halloween or a party or something it would probably pass um, you can see it's got these cute um, uh, they're not buttons they look like buttons um, just details I guess on the side uh, of course it's got the little air holes you can see through it. I can see the screen right now. Like I said, this is nice and shiny and looks good and real. And I really like it. Let's see how it fits. Like I said, it just came earlier today. So I'm not sure. It's kind of whopper jawed, but it should work. <laughs> um it's it's a bit big <laughs> if you can't tell <laughs> it's just a little bit big on me I expected it to be something but that's just a little big um, obviously this is for someone with a longer bigger something head other than mine um, the kids it would be way too big for their head, but I'm sure they'll want to play with this and run around and do all that fun stuff. Um, I am working with a group that uh, is trying to become filmmakers, so we've been making little short movies all summer, and we're going to um, actually start one here soon. I think that this could be a good prop to use in one of the upcoming movies. Hopefully they have a guy wearing it that's got bigger hair. I'm sure if I would have had my hair up in a ponytail or something, it would fit so much better. I'll have to remember that next time. But yes, you can see how it's... Um, just sitting there because like I said it's not a solid hat which I think probably would have looked better but like I said if it's uh, just for a party or Halloween or something like that I'm sure you could get away with um, this if you can't tell I mean I know that the company is not going to like me saying anything bad I love the hat I love the hat, okay? It's just this part you went cheap on. That's the only thing I'm going to say. <laughs> but yes, it seems to be pretty well put together. I didn't have anything feel like it was stabbing me in the head. Oh, man. Um, the details on it are pretty nice. I like it. Uh, this part actually reminds me of those uh, the visor hats like when I went to uh, oh, Cedar Point when I was little they used to have the visor hats where the visor was just like this so I think that might be why I like this so much because it reminds me of something a nice memory but yes this is the chauffeur's hat it's not bad. You saw my only problem, and that's this top part, especially when it sits on your head. It just looks weird. Like you're going to have to try and try and fix it somehow. I I don't even know how you Now I got a big hump in the back. I'm not sure how you would even fix it. Maybe you can put something up in there to shape it out so that you don't have it falling down and you don't have it, or sorry, you don't have it falling down your face and you don't have it falling down up here. But other than that, I really like the hat. 
I cannot wait to use it in one of the movies. And it even could almost be passed off as a police hat, which is kind of what I feel like right here. So, yeah, you could use it for multiple to a multitude of things uh, for Halloween or something like that. So, yes, I'll leave the link down below. Check it out. If you're watching this on Amazon, obviously that doesn't apply to you. But <laughs> please go and check us out on the YouTube channel, Hunka Hunka Burning Reviews. So, yes, that was my review. I like it. It's an A, not an A+. Plus. With a little work, though, it could be an A+. Plus. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate it. Bye.